Hello everyone. So here we are having another question. So first of all, read it out and then we should proceed. An object is having a charge of one coulomb and gains five into 10 to the power 18 electrons. The net charge on the object becomes. So first of all, here we have to find out the total charge on the body. Let us suppose that the total charge on the body is Q and Q1 is basically the charge which is already on the body that is equals to one coulomb. And if it gains, 10, uh, 5 into 10 to the power 18 electrons, then what should be the new charge? So we are going to write down Q2. Q2 will be the charge possessed by this much amount of electron. So we are going to solve it. Q is the total charge on the body. Q1 is one coulomb, which is already given to us. And Q2 is what we have to find out. Now there is a formula of Q is equals to NE. I hope all of you have remembered this formula. So I'm going to write down Q2 is equals to N. Let me tell you that this should be capital N because we know that small n is used to calculate uh, to represent the number density of electron, right? So one coulomb plus N E and from where we got this formula. So I need to write down Q2 is equals to, we all know there is a formula from the quantization. I hope you people remember. So Q is equals to one coulomb plus N. What is N right now? You know that it is given five into 10 raised to the power 18, right? So let me write it into what is the elementary charge? That is charge on the electron, on one electron. It is coming out to 1.6 into 10 raised to the power minus 19, right? So let's complete it equals to, and this is also in Coulomb. So one Coulomb plus, let me remove this point and eight, 16 into five, we all know that 16 into five is coming out to be 80 upon 10. 10, 18 minus 90, right? This is in Coulomb also again. So Q is equals to one Coulomb plus zero cancel out with the zero, eight into 10 raised to the power minus one Coulomb. So let me write it one more time. One coulomb plus eight upon 10 coulomb. This will be equals to Q is equals to one coulomb plus 0 0.8 coulomb. And the final answer is coming out to be, let me write down. Actually, I don't have space right now. So let me write it here. Q is equals to 1.8 Coulomb. And this is coming out to be plus 1.8 Coulomb, right? So I hope you got to know which should be the correct option. The correct option is C option. So C is correct option. I hope all of you got it. Thank you very much.